What if you have both omitted variables, which are constant across entities, but varies over time, and constant over time and varies across entities? If these are separate uh, variables, then you can include both entity fixed effects and time fixed effects. So in our example with fatality rate and beer tax, the combined entity and time fixed effects regression would be that this is our y <coughs> uh, variable and this is our x variable and this is the causal relationship which we are interested in and here we have entity fixed effects And we have time fixed effects. Okay. And what these effects do is that they change not the slope, but the intercept of the regression. So here we have one effect based on the which entity you look at and we have one effect based on which time frame you are looking at. And alpha is the entity fixed effect and delta is the time fixed effect. So now you uh, control for both these effects, okay? So you control for any, any unobserved variable, variable <coughs> which fits these two characteristics. So, and the method you can use to estimate this uh, model is either the within transformation or the LSDV method. And the LSDV method is the more intuitive one because you can make some uh, dummy variables based on the entities and the time, um, time uh, counters. In our um, example, this would be years. And what would this um, dummy variable uh, model look like? So we have our y variable, our x variable, and <coughs> here we have uh, dummy variables based on the entities, right, up to 48. Do not include the first one because this is the um, base case, right? And we do include the dummy variables for uh, each year except the first one because this is again our base case so our base case in this example is state one in year one so <clears throat> and um even if uh even if we um include both time uh, uh, fixed effects and entity fixed effects, they do not um, control for effects which is um, uh, varying both across uh, state and across year. <clears throat> for example, the, the GDP per capita for uh, each state. Um, but remember the, uh, the omitted variable bias, the assumptions, if any such um, variable uh, should uh, create a omitted variable bias, then it must be such that uh, this variable is uh, correlated with uh, the beer tax and it has an effect on the fatality rate. So, see you next time.